Hi, and welcome back to Doomy Gaming and the demo for Frozen Flame. This is a game on Steam that's supposed to come out in fall of 2022. And the description on Steam says it's a challenging exploration and survival adventure set in a dying world of dragons. Only those who harness the power of Frozen Flame have the means to survive the harsh conditions of the realm and able to muster the strength to cleanse it for good. Now, as you know, I'm into survival games, so this looks like it's right up my alley. So let's take a look at this and give it a go and see what it's like. Easy enough. Not too bad. I'm assuming that when that sun mark goes away, we have a decent attack we can use or something. I'm not sure how it works yet. It does look like we have a primary and a secondary attack available to us, though. With the usual right click, left click combo. I'm not sure what this is going to do. There is no time to talk. You have to leave this place as soon as possible. I give you the ability to fly like a bird, head straight into the energy vortex. So on the right hand side of my screen, it says to fly, you have to hit space bar. So let's run, jump, and use the space bar. Oops. Hey. <laughs> I almost went to my death there. Rise again, small pebble. And I assume this is where we make our character. I want a girl. Her hairstyle is good, but let's change the color. Her eyes are blue. And we'll make her skin a tad bit darker. Hit E to accept. From the notes of Risen One, I have found flesh again. Real, warm, strong. Blood flows within me again. Before my mind is completely intoxicated with joy, I will leave a note for those who follow in my footsteps. Remember, only the sorcery of the sacred dragon can release from the prison that Faceless created. Okay. I have freed you, Pilgrim, and now my strength is running out. Go away. The spirit of Faceless is near. Go away. Hmm. Uh-oh. Oh, no. He saved us. Freed us. And it led to his demise. That's not good. We shall meet again, Pilgrim. Find the sanctuary. I'll wait for you there. Now, as with any survival game, I'm assuming that we are going to collect resources, fight some baddies, and be able to craft and build things. So, let's see. Let's see what's in store for us. Oh, I hope we can use bows. I love me a bow and arrow. Cradle of Keepers. Oh, we have a shiny over there. Let's go see what that's all about.
We, the pilgrims, torn from the deaths embraced by the magical flame of the Keeper, vow to fight the cursed ones until our bodies crumble and our souls are extinguished. Okay. So, we can craft things. So we're going to need branches and stone, apparently. And this is our bag. Maximum weight, 60. Okay, and that's our health bar, our stamina bar, I would think. Heat source. Hmm. All right, so let's see what we can craft. We will need branches and stone to start off with. Hello, birdie. You will be shown the way. All right, so stones and branches, so let's collect some. see something shimmering over here okay let's see what we can craft and we can make a fire apparently I don't want to put it down yet but at least we have it in our inventory so The tree has too strong a trunk and axe will not take it. Okay. Alrighty. Are you friendly? I guess so. Be careful of those touched by the curse. What is that? Fiber. Okay. Probably a good material for building. So let's gather some of that stuff. Ooh, more branches. Let's talk to this guy. Not you. Oh, look at that. Another pilgrim has made it out of prison of the faceless. How does it feel? Still sane? I see. You have a nice axe here. How thoughtful. Cradle of Keepers is a dangerous place. Are you embarrassed by the dark spots on my body? It's not my fault. They're blurring. It's the curse. You know what, dude? That looks like my legs. <laughs> as faceless betrayed us all, the world broke down. Arcana is no longer the same as before. You will understand later. Getting used to the realities of this place, that's your main task. Do you think I'll give clues? How can a slow-talking moron like me tell you anything useful? You need to find the memorials. Maybe you can absorb the wisdom of your ancestors. Okay. Consume magic energy from all rune stones nearby. We need three of them. Oh no, and those things lit up. Oh no. And he's attacking me. You were nice, now you're not. Be so mean. And when you hit one, look at they all light up in a different color. Oh, that's not good. You gonna attack me too? Oh, yeah, see? They all attack when you hit these things. Nothing like sending you into a, a mine of devastation. Let's go round about here and keep out of the harm's way while we get this last one. Oh, there's still a pinkish color, which means they're still activated. Is he semi pink or a 
Level up number two. Where's the third? Oh, did I get the rune stones in time? Ah, bummer. Missed me. So I have to get these rune stones in a certain amount of time. What are all those butterflies doing up there? Oh. What's in there? Health potions. Alrighty. I'll take them. Cool. When we get into dire straits. Maybe I ought to clear these guys out before I try that memorial thing again. Seems like... Oh, there it is. Yeah, I missed it. Miss me. Am I getting anything decent from these guys? That's the question. Um, I'll try those rune stones again in a minute, but... Got a box there. I want what's in the box. Don't back away. Come on, dude, die. All right, so I can loot money. Thank you so much. What do you got? Fiber or bandages or something. What's in here? Ragged robe blueprint. Fiber. Apples. What was the other thing? Is that it? Fried mushrooms? Health back up. Mm. What is there? Fiber. Okay. That's well, quick branches, that's for sure. Quick way to get branches. Alright, let's try this again. Alright, so we got all three. Complete the ritual. Okay. 
So I need a workbench. Okay, so I need a workbench, but chances are I probably need to build a hut first. So, is that, okay, Q doesn't work. Apparently I can't set it down here. Probably have to be so far away from this main area, maybe. Okay. What's this? What is that? Poisonous ink mushroom. Indispensable when creating an antidote. Okay. Um, all right, let's figure out where we're going to build a house. Oh, hello, buddy. I just visited your family over there on the other side of town. More money. Thank you for your contribution. Level up. Still can't build anything with Q. Oh, here's another guy. You want a piece of me, buddy? I hope you have something good to share. Look at him backing away. Stop being a bonehead. All right. What does this give me? What is that? Sugar boarberry leaves. An infusion of sugar leaves you tougher? All kinds of stuff to gather here, guys. It's over there. A bridge. <clears throat> Excuse me. A What's this? Summer tree beetle. Okay, what does that do? Insect meat. The beetle is an ingredient for cooking a dish which has the effect of lightning protection. Oh, okay. This looks like a nice area over here to build. Probably can't be too close to that monument though, but this looks like a really nice area right in here. Not sure how tall we can build though. Or um, can you build on rocks I wonder? Like up here with, is a really nice looking scenery area with bridges leading over to the other side. I wonder if we could build here. Let's, um, hmm, let's put. Wait a minute. Did I already make one? Let me see. I did. So. Let's put this down somewhere. This is my teleportation for the game. All right, so we can teleport back to this spot. And if we look on our map, yeah, <clears throat> Sentinel, this is where we can teleport back to from anywhere else in the world, I assume. All right, so let's see if we can build here. Now we can hit Q. Um... How do we make the foundation taller? Okay, let's not do a foundation. Let's do a post. So, here. And then, 
then do uh, a floor. Can we do a floor on top of the post? We can. That's awesome. It looks like I made one too many. So it's one, two, three. One, two, three. Um, one, two, three, four, five. Obviously, he's going to have to put a ramp in here so I can get up. Because I can't seem to get up. But I want, uh, this is one, two, three, four, five, two by five, uh, three by five at least. Why won't you go where I want you to go? There. All right, pick up these branches. Okay, now we can make a ramp, I hope, to get up there. Here. Well, it's not perfect, but at least it'll get me up here. Um, yeah, so let's pick those up. Obviously going to have to expand this, but for now, let's see if we can make some walls. I am so glad that these do not attack you unless they're provoked. Or you hit one of those memorials because <laughs> they could probably kill me before I got back to the base. And I hope this stuff here regenerates too. Yeah, I'll add those pieces in a, in a minute. And I'm going to put another ramp here too, but... For now, I just want to get the ceiling done, so let's go back into queue, make another one of these, put it up there. And go here. I have to get one of those other pieces here. All right, so those pieces are in place. So I'm assuming that I can just finish off the roof with this. get on the top then to put well actually I should put the top ones on first or it probably doesn't matter all right let's just do this and stick it down even though the ceiling's not finished apparently it will and this has to be blue to sit down right all right so let's get rid of these logs because they're encumbering me and let's put some of this other stuff in here too. Not that. The coins can go in there, that can go in there. Alright, let me make a workbench before I put those in. Workbench. Craft it. Alright, so we got a workbench. Now because we picked up that uh, rag, ragged robe. Did I, did I learn it? E to learn it? I must have learned it. Light apparel for a torso, so I need four fabric to make it. I only have two, so I can't make it. All right, so I need 
for two ones I need one two three four five five floors but I don't know if I can make floors oh no I can't because I need more sticks more branches now we work through the night too Now I'm wondering if I can chop these trees down and then teleport back to my base so I don't have to walk bow leg it when I get encumbered. Be a good test. So now in order to teleport you go to the map and say yes. I just want to test it and show you what it does and it brings you back to your teleportation thingy my bobber which is cool it doesn't want to put it in come on there there we go so it's not the best base but it's a base and that's all that matters. E to add a log. E to open. Let's cook it, see what happens. Oh, look at that. We actually got a, uh, we actually got something. So collect that with an R. Cool. Mm. Let's see if you can cook the apples. So it gives you the same thing apparently. No, it's different. So this is a fruit dessert time. So this is a health regen plus one. So it's different. This is physical resistance plus five. Dude, he was picking on you, and I, I helped you. Light armor. I can't change armor in combat? Well, why is it hitting me? So now I have a bubble head. <laughs> I need to find flint, but this lit up armor will come in handy for nighttime scavenging and fighting. But I need flint. Let's see, if I get a pickaxe, I can chop I can chop these bigger ones. But I need to find flint. Here you are, buddy. I thought I heard you. broke can he come up here let's make another axe oh we can't we need two branches ah <sighs> I guess that's what happens. What does rebirth mean? So 
Do I lose everything on me? No. Okay. Um, all right. Well, this is good because I have to make, uh, I need branches to make another axe and there's some in here. So, I just, I think you should be able to repair the one you have. I mean, I guess not. We can make this now. Try meat. That should give us some more health back. Let's go get that booger head that killed us and show him who's boss. And then we're going to find those pieces of flint that we need. Oh, look at my essence is still up here on the rock. I gathered the flame from dying. That's what you get, buddy. Hey, buddy. The boxes regenerate it. the other guy's body that I killed. Where'd he go? Hey, I got robbed. Fried something, poor man's chowder. Luminous apple. And holy water vessel. So, poor man's chowder, bonus health of 50. Ooh, let's use that. That's nice to know that you can come back down here and get some stuff from these guys. But I need flint. I need more than two pieces. for this. I need <clears throat> four pieces of flint. So I need three more flint. But if I go and hit rocks now, I should be able to get more flint from them. All right. 
right, so I know there's some over here. There's another piece laying right there. Three pieces, was it? It was. So now I can make my club, my spiky club. Okay, this uh, pickaxe, you can go up to these here and get flint, stone, and coal from them. See, there's flint, stone, and then coal. So that's cool. All right. So I'm not quite sure how long we've been playing this, but this gives you the gist of what this game entails. And we can play more later, but I don't want to make this first demo video too long. But I want to thank you for, you know, being here with me and giving me some of your time. I know time is precious something that we can never get back. So I do appreciate the fact that you come here and spend it with me. It means everything to me that you're here. You're such amazing people. So uh, if you haven't subscribed already, please subscribe to my channel and hit that notification bell so you can be notified when I upload a new video, whether it be, you know, one for this game or another game. And, uh, and I'll see you back here again real soon. So until then, you take care, be safe, have fun. And I'll see you soon. Ciao.